So here's a question I get a lot. What can I do with a physics degree? Or well, as someone who's just done a physics degree and is now a PhD student in physics, I thought I'd give my take on an answer to this question. But I'm going to base it on personal stories from my friends and classmates. Um, my thoughts on this topic of employability in physics are based on largely on anecdotes and of course employability is something that's going to differ widely depending on which country you're in or what kind of person you are. So I'll post some links in the description to some more stats or research based information on this topic and just tell you what I think. The truth is that if you're a motivated student then you can do almost anything with a physics degree. This is because whilst you're learning physics, that's not the only thing you're doing. You're not just memorizing facts about uh, atoms or space-time. You're also learning how to code simulations or to process large amounts of data. You're learning to critically evaluate research and to communicate ideas. This is what makes a physics graduate uh, employable to a broad range of careers because any industry that's needing to understand trends and data and to use that for their advantage they're going to find your skills useful and that's pretty much every industry nowadays. Whilst I chose to go on and do a PhD in physics many of my friends did not and they went straight out and got jobs whether that was at the government in roles such as defense, policy modeling, or nuclear science. Others went down the road of becoming a high school teacher, or they went into medical physics, working in a hospital, or into science communication, either as a journalist or a technical writer. Actually, most people that I know who got graduate jobs are working as software developers of some kind, whether that's for a startup, for a medical devices company, or at Google. Since physics is so closely linked to engineering, I also know a few people who have gone on into engineering fields, whether that's rocketry or material science. How well placed you are for these sorts of jobs really depends on what kind of internships or research projects you choose to do during your degree. So for example, if you want to end up in some sort of software job, try to pick to work on projects that involve a lot of coding and try to participate in related competitions and stuff in your own time as well. I did a couple of um, research internships, both at a university and an observatory, and those were really good for me because I wanted to go into postgrad and do research, but doing things that you know are going to help you get to where you want to go are going to be what sets you apart from other people. A fair number of physics students do stay on and do postgrad, and I think that's just because the kind of curious people that want to study physics in the first place are also kind of the people that want to do their own research. You could go down this path and endeavor to become a postdoc or a lecturer or a professor um, and stay in the academic circles or at any time you can go out and, and get an industry job. With a physics degree you can even do post-grad studies in another discipline. Popular choices would be maths or computer science, another kind of science, or even finance or business. In fact, a lot of the PhD students I'm working with now have um, ambitions to eventually create startup businesses from some of their research or from the skills they're learning in physics. Pretty much, if you're creative and are not afraid of applying your skills to an unfamiliar area, you can do whatever you want with a physics degree. Physics has a reputation for being hard, and what you're doing by completing a physics degree is showing any potential employer that you're good at tackling new problems and 
you are motivated by learning new things. So good luck.